Ryan KitKat is one of the most impressive photo editors built into a mobile operating system. It's not Photoshop, but it does offer a lot of options for fine-tuning your photos. Let's take a look. To start editing, find a photo you want to edit in the Gallery app and tap that pencil icon. At the bottom here, you have a few options. Filters, frames, cropping and transformation tools, and advanced adjustments. The Adjustments tool is what really sets this photo editor apart. It lets you fine-tune anything from exposure and contrast to highlights and curves, tools that you'd normally find in a more advanced photo editor. One of the most useful adjustments is the Local option. With it, you can change the exposure for a specific part of the photo. Just tap it, adjust the size of the spot, and drag it over the area you want to tweak. Then, choose your tool, like brightness, and use the slider to make the adjustments. You can even add an additional spot with this icon here. At any point within the editor, you can drag down from the top to view the original photo. You can also head to Menu, then Show Applied Effects to see which tools you used. For you super editors, there's even a way to create your own custom preset filter after you've made your edits. Head back to the Filter tab, then swipe left until you see this plus sign. Tap it, give your filter a name, and it'll be added alongside the defaults. When you're ready to save your photo, you have a couple options. Hit Save, which overrides the original, or tap Menu, then Export to adjust the size and quality before saving. That option saves the edited photo as a new file. For more about KitKat's photo editor, head on over to howto.cnet.com. And as always, hit me up with questions on Twitter. For CNET, I'm Sharon Vaknin.